Happy birthday to you. Well, if you're not familiar with this channel, let me just tell you that the scenes that you just watched are not typical of what I normally post. For the first eight months of being here in Alaska, I was alone and isolated from most other people. Rarely did I ever see anybody, and that was only if I left the property to go get supplies, which I only did at the very beginning of arriving here. My contractor has been here for the last month refurbishing my cabin, and over the last couple of weeks, we've had a number of people in and out of the property. We celebrated a birthday here at the cabin, and um, that was my contractor's birthday. And I appreciate the fact that he was willing to work through his birthday. And so he did ask if his parents could come out to celebrate, and I said, certainly. And so we had them come out. We had a couple children on the property as well. And then I also had a coworker come out and stay with me. And she and I went and did some sightseeing over the last couple of weeks as well. So I want to, you know, go ahead and show you all the things that have taken place over these last couple of weeks. And you have to forgive me. I'm trying to stay out of the sun. Um, and so the lighting may not be the best, but I also wanted to say thank you for everyone for your well wishes since I didn't post a video last week. Um, Kenai and I are doing just fine. It was just a bit chaotic around here. And the week previously, I didn't really get much footage um, because it is peak season for my day job. And so I wanna make sure that you get a quality video and not just a video, just to keep up with posting. But I also wanted to say thank you to everybody who has subscribed and continues to watch my channel because the channel has really grown over the past uh, few weeks. I, a couple weeks ago, I posted a community post asking people uh, for their questions and that I would do a Q&A video coming up. So if you're new here and you have questions for me, you can always post them in the comment section down below. But if you can go back to my channel page and find that community post, if you post your questions there, there's a good chance they'll wind up in that Q&A video that I have coming up. So Again, I want to thank everybody for all of your support and your well wishes. I really appreciate it. And so I'm not going to delay any further. Let's get right into what the last couple weeks have entailed. This last week started off by replacing these old posts. <laughs>
Um, my contractor is going to come down. He's going to remove all the insulation from the ceiling here and then this back corner over here behind the water tank. And I'm having it done because rodents nested in it and it's really filled with just filth. And so it's got to go. And I'm going to turn this into my root cellar. It's the entire footprint of the cabin. It's 30 by 30 feet. And I have a lot of options down here. In the root cellar, I have a lot of space to play around with what I want to do. The one corner that won't be touched is this one here where the uh, water storage is. And this water storage is strictly used just for fire suppression. So if this was your root cellar, what would you do to make this as usable as possible? And I've got some ideas of things that I'd like to see done in here, but for now, we're gonna start with removing the insulation. So gross. There is a reason why I'm paying somebody to do that. And it's because that's disgusting. <laughs> like I'll do a lot of work. I don't have a problem actually getting my hands dirty and doing certain things. But um, rodent feces, mm -mm. I'll pay someone to deal with that. And luckily I've got people that are willing to help. So, but uh, I feel bad for my contractors, but at least they're doing it. Nasty. <laughs> the moment we've all been waiting for the Arctic entry. Let the demolition begin.
now we're off to McCarthy, where we'll take a flight over the Wrangell Mountains.
I hope that you'll stick around to see all the progress that I make on the cabin over the course of this summer. And speaking of sticking around, if you've made it this far into the video and you haven't subscribed, please do. Obviously you like what you see and there's more to come. I promise to take you through the entire process of replacing the roof and adding that entrance to the cellar, as well as many other adventures that I've planned for this summer. Also, if you could give this video a thumbs up if you found it useful or in entertaining, as well as share the video with your friends and family. If you feel so kind to leave a comment, I'll do my best to read it and to reply. I don't get a chance to reply to everybody. Sometimes they get held up and I have to go searching for them, but I do attempt to make an honest effort to give everybody a response. If you took the time to comment to me, I'd like to take the time to let you know that I appreciate that. So thanks for watching. I'll see you again next week. And if you're new to the channel and you haven't seen my other videos, be sure to check out these videos. This is the one that YouTube recommends and these are the ones that I recommend.